See, there is a term gastonuri, which is also known as streptonuri. The meaning of this term is crossing of nerves, and this can be observed in the gastropod mollusk. You know, phylum mollusca is divided into uh, several classes, and one of the classes is gastropoda. Animals of this class they show tarsan, that is their uh, paleovisceral organs get twisted 180 degree. So because of this phenomenon, because of twisting of visceral organs and pallial organs or organs of pallial complex, the nerves which are present in the larval forms, they also get uh, rotated 180 degree. And because of that, you will find that some of the uh, nerves, they are actually crossing each other. So that gives the structure of uh, English 8. And this phenomenon is known as chiastonuri or streptonuri. See, as I said that this happens because of tarsan. Tarsan is a developmental phenomenon. This occurs only in gastropod mollusk and uh, the in this process the visceropallial organs like visceral organs means alimentary canal heart uh, kidney gonads these structures and organs of pallial complex like gills and uh, then osphradium so these are certain structures which are present in the pallial cavity they actually rotate 180 degree from their initial position in the larval development. And because of this tarsan, the mantle cavity, which is present in the posterior side, in the back side of the animal, that gets shifted to the anterior side. So because of this, the mantle cavity with its pallial complex is brought to the front of the adult body. So this is major change which happens and you can understand this particular thing in this diagram. See, uh, these are two stages. The first one, this left one, is the larval stage and this right one is the adult form. So you see what are the changes uh, taking place in this larval form. See, this is larva. Suppose here this a left structure is actually the left one is uh, its head portion you can see this faint line is actually the alimentary canal mouth is located here so this alimentary canal is almost a straight tube which is opening inside the pallial cavity or mantle cavity so in the posterior side this one is a mantle cavity in the mantle cavity you can see the presence of gill and in this cavity, the alimentary canal opens through the anal opening. This is the cavity in which the uh, excretory system will also be opening. That is, renal opening will be present. Opening of gonad will also be there. That is, genital uh, openings will be there. So, this is larva actually. But because of the twisting of visceral organs, that is, those structures which are present in the inner portion, they actually start uh, moving uh, to the uh, anterior side and uh, they actually rotate 180 degree. During the process, this mantle cavity is also gets shifted to the anterior side. So you will find that in case of adult, this elementary canal, you see, it has twisted 180 degree, completely 180 degree and the mantle cavity it has also come close to the mouth. Gills, which was actually posteriorly directed, it is now present in the anterior side. And this anal opening, it, it has come uh, to the side of uh, mouth. So it actually causes some of the problems also to the animal because the excretory content, the fecal matter that gets actually released close to the mouth. But this animal actually overcomes the problem because water currents are maintained in such a way that uh, all these things which are excretory or which are fecal content are immediately removed 
uh, from the body. But see, uh, due to this, you will find a lot of uh, changes occur. One of the changes is uh, in the structure of nerves. You know, in case of mollusk, the nervous system is formed of ganglia, then commissures, connectives, and fine nerves. So, mainly the connectives, they get twisted in such a way that we find uh, some of the nerves crossing each other, and that phenomenon is known as gastonuri. So, this you can understand in this uh, line diagram. Gastonuri you can really understand here. See, in this uh, left side of line diagram, this round structure is left cerebral ganglion. This is left cerebral ganglion. This one is right cerebral ganglion. Here this is pedal ganglion. This is also pedal ganglion. You can say left and right pedal ganglion. Then left and right pleural ganglia are there. Then you can see infra intestinal ganglion. This is infra intestinal ganglion or sub intestinal ganglion which is situated below the intestine. This one is supra intestinal ganglion or it is a ganglion which is actually present on the uh, means upper portion of the intestine. And then these are visceral ganglia. Okay. So you can see that it is almost a uh, simple symmetrical structure present in the larval form. But this larva actually uh, we have just seen that in case of larva, uh, the visceral organs and the organs of pileal complex get twisted 180 degree. So because of that, some of the ganglia of this left side will be coming to the right side and vice versa. So see in this structure, the uh, infra-intestinal ganglia, which is present here, this infra-intestinal ganglia, it has come to the right side. Earlier it was present in the left side, but now it has come to the right side. And supra-intestinal ganglia, which is present in the right side, it has come to the left side. And definitely there would be twisting in this you know, visceral ganglia also. So because of that, you find a structure, eight-like structure, means this particular structure is actually crossing here. This one is actually infra-intestinal nerve. This is supra-intestinal nerve. This you can refer as infra-intestinal visceral connective. This is supra-intestinal visceral connective. This one is supra-intestinal visceral connective. So here, the nerves actually cross each other. And this phenomenon is known as chiastonuri. So this is the thing uh, we should understand that some of the nerves actually they cross each other and the phenomenon is chiastonuri. You can see this is the uh, nervous system of pila which is uh, commonly known as apple snail. So exactly the same thing is shown here. Uh, although this diagram looks a little bit complicated although it is the complete you know nervous system of pila here you can see the two uh, cerebral ganglia that is left and right cerebral ganglia this one is cerebral commissure connecting the two and then you can see the pleuropedal ganglionic mass present here in the left side and in the right side supraintestinal ganglion is here in the uh, left side although it was actually present in the right side of the larva these are visceral ganglia so exactly what happens that you are observing that the infraintestinal nerve is here, supraintestinal nerve is here. So they actually cross each other and because of this, this chiastonuri is actually observed. So in chiastonuri, the right supraintestinal nerve, nerve which is actually going from the upper side of uh, intestine, that moves left and the left subintestinal or infraintestinal nerve that actually gets shifted to the right side making a structure of eight uh, and uh, um, with, with the visceral and pleural ganglia so this actually involves the visceral and pleural ganglia and that is why we are able to observe such a structure some lineages means some forms of uh, mollusk 
especially those which belong to the group Aphistopranks, they have reversed this coiling, means their occurs detarsion in them. And because of this uh, detarsion, that is, they experience torsion, but immediately after that, there would be, you know, um, movement of such a structure just, uh, you know, to it, to their earlier form. And uh, in case of gastropods, those gastropods which show detarsion, they do not depict chiastonuri. In their case, this chiastonuri cannot be observed. And uh, because these nerves no longer cross, and this is actually called as euthenuri. Euthenuri means true uh, uh, neuron, you know, or connectives are present in their, uh, in their structure. They are not crossing each other. So that actually situation comes only after detarsion. And this phenomenon is referred as euthenuri. That is, they have retained their earlier position.